We were not far from our home and the shoof. There was a cut in the hill that we had to pass through. I, I saw on the hill some people running. They were running. Terrible. They were running to the corner of the hill. Then they began shooting. Suddenly our car went out of the road. I realized something terrible was happening. When the car stopped, it was quiet all around. I looked at my husband. It was terrible. I can't. I can't handle to remember it. Later, later soldiers arrived. They were only two minutes away from us. They came. They jumped from their vehicle. Then there was again shooting. The soldiers and I fell on the ground behind the car because they started again to shoot at us. I just fell on the ground and prayed. I prayed that he will be alive. Thanks God, it happened. He was taken to the operation room. It was for seven hours. We all prayed and asked that he will receive help, that he would recover and be well. It was terrible. All the parts on different places were changed. Parts were taken from different places, from the bottom and the top, close to the eye. Now it is most important that after the operation, Valery will become well and that he will not have other problems and complications. <laughs> My life has turned around completely. From the moral and financial aspects, it's difficult, very difficult. We hope very much that soon everything will be in the past and we begin to work and live as we lived before.